How has it come to fog and frost already? Sick of it. It's 20 past nine and I've not long been up, if I'm honest with you. Let's try that again, shall we? I've not long been up and I want to go to the charity shop, grab a few things, because I know there's going to be some stuff there because it is a Friday. And I should have gone yesterday, but I didn't. Yesterday's when I have a nice little restock. So I probably missed out on a few bits. <laughs> but it doesn't matter. I'm going to go there. I can almost guarantee I'm going to get a few bits. I'll show you that. It's 9.23. That needs a good dust. The house, the car needs a good clean. And the house is being clean. What is that? There's a hair somewhere. I'd say enough waffling, but I'm just letting the car warm up a little bit because it's freezing in here, man. It's honestly so cold. I'm sick of it. Like... It hasn't even been, this is probably the first cold morning we've had and I'm already done with it. I'm already done. Eight degrees. That's nothing. That's sound. Hopefully there's a car beat on tomorrow. So I can get my little legs out and freeze in the field. Right, let's go and see what we can find. Honestly, it's like a graveyard. Look at the fog. Beautiful. It looks nice. Just not the best feeling on the fingers. Hopefully there's one or two things left in here. Morning, 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 morning. Ooh. Swan. Massimo Dutti. Is that a long sleeve? Yeah, I'll have a go on that. Finest fabric. What's wrong with it? I normally price their duty up. Vintage Ralph. Hey, quid, skip on that. Skip on that. Skip pink. Skip the Shadow Various. Skip the Callaway. Oh, you're leaving some brands. Shut up. It's all about the stars as well. Ciao Italy, that feels very, we'll look at that in a minute. Little Gant fur one. I'm actually just gonna pick a few off and I'll show you when we finish picking them off. This brand, there seems to be like nice strong listed prices, but solds, zero, or like a tenner. Uh, somebody must have got it out on credit yesterday. All right, today are you? Very good, you okay? Yeah, I'm fine. Grand. Get into that weather in it. Oh, heated gloves, look at that. Should I, should I get some heated gloves? No. Good mornings. Morning, love. Oh, look at you, it's new hairdo. Oh yeah, I chopped it off. Have you not seen it yet? No, I've been away. Yes, flopped it all off. Let's go. That looks better, doesn't yeah. it? <laughs> yeah. That does look better. I just had the itch to grow it. I've grown it, I've done it, did done nothing it. with it, it and now it can all go up. off. Keep buying anything. I'm going to get some bits, yeah, don't you worry. Always find some stuff. These are the Christmas stuff. Here. I don't like Christmas. Huh? I don't like Christmas. Why? I just, I just, I'm just not a fan of it. Yoot. Yoot. Art pewter. I'm tempted just for one fifty. Is it nice? Somebody will want that. Oh, somebody's opened that. I reckon they've nicked it. Nearly, my lovely. Nearly, nearly. It's a good song. Oh dear. So by the look of it, I think it's missing a slide part just there. So even for a pound, it's probably not bothered. Mine, Nearly, my lovely. Are you getting me? What's that one? Celebrity guessing game? Yeah. No, not for me. Not No, I'm not very quizzy. What? I know, I'm, I'm, not, I'm not very smart. <laughs> A cross pen, oh my goodness. Are you buying anything? Hopefully. Oh, this. Oh, it's going to tuck out in it. There you go. Bye bye. It's nice, little gypsy wagon. That is nice. Are you buying anything? I'm very close to. I've got a few bits. I can always find something, you see. No. Come in with. Do you celebrate Christmas? I do celebrate it. I do celebrate it because obviously we've got kids and stuff, but I think it's a bit too, what's the word, commercial. Where are your kids at school? Yeah, they're at school now at the minute. Where? You know? Yeah. 
Yeah, they go to school there. The man there. That's it. Oh. oh, I've got it. Don't you worry. Thank you, lovely. You. Thank you. Can are you picking them up? I'm picking them up later. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Taking them to dance. Taking her to dancing. Two girls. One girl, one boy. The boy doesn't go dancing. The girl, goes the girl, yeah, the girl goes Where? dancing. Um, is it called? Where is that? Um, is it? That's actually another school. I can't remember the name of the school though. But I think it might be there. Yeah. Oh. Top. Yeah. Is, is it yeah, that's it. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. I'm pretty sure that's where the. Um, I'm pretty sure that's where the dancing is. I'm pretty sure. How old is the cool girl? Uh, it's four, four and twelve. No, four and four and thirteen. Who the biggest? Uh, the boy, fourteen, thirteen. Yeah, boy's the biggest. Um, are you picking them um, both up from work? Nope, just one, just a little girl. With the boy makes his own way back. Where from? Um, what's the name of the school? Yeah. So you know more than I do. Yeah. I forget I do. I always forget. Are you walking? No, I'll pick her up. Oh, yeah, I'll walk to pick her up, yeah. He he will walk home himself, though. Man up, man up, man up. Are you giving Taddy, eh? Tadley, yeah, that's me. Uh, be close. So just down the bottom. You know where the bottom bit is? Yeah, you walk here. Yeah, I walk. No, I drove here today. I drive. Because I, I, I never know what I'm going to find. I never know if I need a car or if I need to walk. Sometimes I find lots, sometimes I only find a little bit. She's, uh, where's she gone today? She's gone to Winchester. She's gone out for the day. She's gone to get some lunch and some stuff. She's gone to give me a bit of peace. When are you going back to work? Um, Monday. Monday. Who are you picking her up from school? Me, me still. Why not them? Because she, she actually works. She actually works there. She's a, she, she's a teacher, Mrs. Wright. Everyone knows her as. Oh yeah. Yeah, that's my that's the that's my part that's my partner. What is that, Ginty? Are you getting it? Not sure yet. Never know. Not bye sure bye. yet. Bye bye, my lovely. <laughs> What's this you're doing here? That's a gift card, isn't it? You've got one of them, you never bring it with you. Yeah, what I mean is, I've got one, but I can't scan mine anymore. There's no yeah. scanner one. I can't get a scanny one. Or does that take too much to reprogram it? I don't know, I don't know. Nah, 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 I can't bother. I can only do Nah, it's a pain in the ass. I'm sure, I'm pretty sure it is. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you. Just a quick little pop into the local charity shop and I've managed to add a few more quid to my eBay store. And that's all that matters at the moment. Just keep topping it up, keep topping it up. Because when I tell you I've probably got thousands of pounds worth of stuff just lying around here that I am slowly making a dent in. I'm not joking. Some nice little surprising things here. This is a pewter kilt pin. So it's a pin to hold your kilts in. This all. Quite a nice looking one. £1.50. I should be seeing around about 20 odd quid back from that. I think you can get up to like £35 for these just by doing a quick bit of research. So I am a business seller, but I do sell like a private individual and I'll be undercutting everyone. I've been doing that for ages. <laughs> Another one that some of you guys might not be aware of, you know, about your parkers and all those kind of stuff. But this is a brand called Cross. Hello. Wink, wink. Wink, 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 wink. Cross is a fantastic brand. They've been going around for many, many years. This was a shocking £2. I've just realised it's actually a retractable pencil, not a pen. Really well made. You can just tell by how they feel. But this is, here you go, look. It's actually a pencil. Are you going to focus? Definitely not going to focus, are you? Let's try it. If I can get this to focus, I'll go and buy an iPhone 16 just to say thank you. I can't. There we go. Pens can go up to thousands. Obviously, this one isn't going to be that kind of thing. It is missing the top case cover, which is a shame. Pens can go from anywhere to unlimited and anywhere under that as well so it could be a pound it could be ten thousand pound or anywhere in between sock age you see me pick this up for two pounds now what i like to do with these is is work out what the market value is and then go much lower so as long as i'm still making it worth my while and somebody else can get a good deal on something that they need 
that's how I like to work on the medical stuff. I'm not trying to be Mr. Good Guy, Mr. Samaritan, but that's just how I like to do it. I don't care about people making profit on medical stuff. Crack on, man. That's where most of the money is. The medical industry makes so much money from you by keeping you sick. It is unreal. But we'll save that for the tin hat. Paid £2 for this. Brand new, you can get up to around about £35. So pre-owned, I'd imagine, 25 ish 20 I'll list this for... What's going to cover my postage and fees? I'll list this for 14 99 and get it gone. It's in remarkable condition. So Massimo Duty now, finest fabric. I can't believe it was in there for £3.50. What a ridiculous... I just don't... I, just, I, don't I, just, I told you the restock was there. I reckon I've missed loads, you know. It's a size Euro large, but that's never a large. So it could be a woman's, maybe. My buttons are on this side. Don't know. Nice little brand to look out for there. I don't really know about the value. It's going to be about 18 quid, I should imagine. And then a Gant super fine lamb's wool quarter zip top. And most of you know about Gant already by now. If not, you should. This one's very fluffy. I could never wear something like this. The thought of that on my skin just makes me... <laughs> Gross. But for £4.50, it can go on somebody else's skin, can't it? Estimation, 18 to 20. Not bad for a quick pop into the charity shop. Got another young lady who's currently volunteering at the moment, bless her. She wanted to know everything that I was doing. The other day I went mental on a whatnot Pokemon stream and spent stupid amounts of money and got nothing worth my, for my money. I was gambling, basically. Doing those stupid dip, spin wheel things, whatever. I ended up with a ton of cards. I'm just going to send them all to Matt. Matt can just deal with them and... Sell them all off. Project Games, if most of you don't know, he's the best at all that. And he, and he can be bothered. I can't. I just can't. I don't know why I did it. I was hoping, obviously, I was going to hit it big and then be like, well, that's nice and easy to deal with. Another quick update on the Vinted Pro situation. When I logged in there yesterday onto the web version, went onto my account, it said, continue application or cancel. And I was like, sweet. So I cancelled the application. So no longer is my profile going to go ahead with the national insurance debacle even though they are now asking for national insurance i'm guessing the fact that they're now asking for it means they've found a way that they're going to be hiding it i am going to leave it for a while and if the national insurance number is always going to be displayed there's going to be some serious problems with vintage so i'd imagine that's not what they're planning to do moving forward so i'm going to let it just ride out for a bit first my shop is still on holiday mode i'm still letting them orders complete and i'm still uploading to vintage as well got loads coming on there so when I take my shop off holiday mode, fastest finger first, run, go and get it. I don't know if this video is going to come out today or not. So I'm going to say today for a minute because I am going to crack on and do some work. It is only, what, 10 o'clock-ish? So I still need, some, still need to do some stuff, really. And I've got nothing planned for the video. Twelve on eBay. This Five guy on eBay. is a f***ing wind-up merchant. He's got you oh, lot absolutely oh, twisted up and bent, so, any. Start off straight away Look, a good sale. If you're on a private account or a business account, I understand the whole, I'm a business reseller, these are getting away with it on privates. I'm a business reseller. The fact catches on a private doesn't make a blind bit of difference to my life whatsoever. And I know it's easy to say, but it shouldn't to yours too. If you were always focused on what somebody else had or didn't have compared to what you have, you'd never get anywhere in life. I do, but bear in mind, I'm not blind. I do see where the polarisation is. I do get it. But let me tell you, this man's trolling you all right now. <laughs> He's just like, <laughs> will it come back and bite him in the ass? Maybe. Or will it just get to a point where eBay says you need to be a business now? And he just goes, all right then, I've milked it for as long as I can. Let's go. Don't let anything like that stress you out. Cadge is living his life. Everyone else just lives theirs. You know what I mean? Fucking wind up merchant, this bloke. Them blokes I picked up at the... One of my main goals today is that classic, I'm going to have a sort out kind of moment. I've had this box down here full of clothing. I'm pulling out like quality garments from it. It's just sat in this box for ages. I'm going to empty the box, get it all on the rail. Now I've made space on the rail and then get ready to start moving it on. It's been out for ages. That is a box full of computer games. I was going to send him off to Jack, but his, his price was too small for me. It was a good price, but I paid... Basically, on the rare, this is one of them rare occasions where I paid 25 and he wanted to give me 25. Does that make sense? And that's just bad business. So I can't do that. So now I've got to do the graft. But yeah, just like so much cool shit in here. I mean, straight away, look at that. Bell staff trousers. Just chilling. Just doing nothing. He's been in here for ages. So that's my job. But I found this as well. Nice little top. Jenny Packham. Just chilling. 
vintage US Air Force jumper. It's got holes, it's got stains, it's got marks, but it's old AF, do you know what I mean? What do you expect? AF, Air Force, all right? That's one of my jobs today, basically. I've had to pause Kaji again. Have you not read his comments? <laughs> I've gone on a real mad sorting mission to be honest. I'm actually getting through these console stuff. I've decided to try it out on Marketplace. We've got an Xbox One, PS3 and a bunch of games. I'm going to separate the listings. But while I'm here, I'm actually watching something called Living on the Line in 1985. And let me tell you something. It ain't much different from today and that is sad, sad news. Sad news. I've actually got a lot done today, but I don't actually think this video is going anywhere. So I've decided to quit while I'm ahead. I can't even think what's been done. I actually have no idea. I've just been cracking on. Managed to get loads of that console stuff sorted out. That's now listed. And I'm just working through some of these boxes and whatever else. Just sorting stuff out. I've lost myself. I was filming, but I got too carried away in work. And I lost where I was. That's how it is, isn't it, sometimes? Hey, I appreciate you watching anyway. Take care. See you in the next one.